it. So one other thing I'd love to do to help you save a little more money is to sign up for texts with us if, if you haven't yet because we can stay in touch with you, let you know what's coming up, events, all those types of things. And our thank you for doing that is to give you 15% off your first purchase uh, or of any kind. You can text HSN to 7514. And once we start texting, we're gonna let you take 15% off of your uh, item of choice up to $50. So it could even be a higher ticket item. All righty, Chef Shahir yep. Masood. More we fun. move into waffle making season. Yes. Okay, this is an awesome little appliance. It really, Love little it. being the operative word, yeah. but it packs a punch because you can do both the stuffed waffles yep. and the famous Belgian waffles. Exactly. So we, we were so smart at Kitchen HQ to make stuffed waffles. You put that little insert in there. Yep. You put the batter, put the filling, which I'll show you in a second. And then you close it, you're making stuffed waffles. If you want just normal waffles, mm -hmm. take out that insert mm -hmm. and then you just press down. Ah, Straight that's up the key waffles. right there, yeah. That's it. So you don't have to just make stuffed waffles. You can go plain waffles, wow. you can go stuffed waffles. We're gonna do sweet and savory waffles. Ooh. I mean, you could do it all. Uh, do it while it's 50% off, I'm gonna just say. Yep. It's half price tonight. We've got red, we've got white, we've black. This is also on five flex, so it's, are you ready? $3.99. I mean, this would be crazy. so much fun for you and your family. Of for course. For the kids, everybody loves to make waffles and get involved, and then the eating part. <laughs> so I, I do wanna say something about the waffles. So a lot of people are in a rut. Eggs, bacon, cereal, pancakes, on repeat, right? Waffles, and a lot of people haven't made waffles before, are actually basically a glorified pancake batter that's a little bit thicker, that's it. And Callie, I've developed a ton of recipes for this waffle maker that you get as well. So once you get nice. it out of the box, you start cooking right away. So here I've got a little basic chocolate waffle batter. And again, it's basically a pancake batter with a little bit uh, more flour to make it a little bit thicker. But we're talking about mm. pantry staples, egg, flour, butter, little baking powder, here I've got a little bit of cocoa powder just to change up the flavor. Mm. I stuff it with strawberries and then I put a little bit more on top. I have that insert to make it kind of thicker so it holds that stuffing. I close it, lock, lock it down, it, and that's it. You let it do its thing. It's gonna take about eight, nine minutes. And like I always say, oh, we can take a peek. Like nothing bad's gonna happen if we take a peek after five minutes and okay, needs okay. more time, needs less time. You can absolutely take a peek. No worries. It's easy. It's fun, and it's wow. interactive. Look when you at talk how about thick doing they stuff, become. well, they they have that now room for yeah. the filling. Here is a savory one that I did with some cheddar and jalapeno, a little bit of fried chicken on the inside. I mean, just look, and it's golden on the outside. No kidding. Again, you get the recipes, and we're talking about pantry staples. Lots of people have never made waffles before, and they're like, I don't know how to do it. I don't know if I can do it. You can. If you can make a pancake, you can make a waffle. Flour, egg. Butter, a little bit of you know, uh, baking powder, pinch of salt, and then from there, you can mix up flavors. Little cocoa powder, you got chocolate waffles. Little matcha mm. powder, green tea waffles. Mm. Cherry cheesecake. I know. Waffles. Like you can go cherry nuts. Cherry cheesecake. Absolutely. Put None a little cream less. cheese, little cherries in there. Oh my. Okay. Oh, so this here's now just warm. a basic waffle batter. Like I said, it's basically pancake batter, right? You can even just buy a store-bought if you like, but you can do this. You've got pastry, uh, pantry staples at home, little cheddar and a little jalapeno. So you can go savory, you can go sweet, and again, to do it stuffed, you top it with more batter. Beautiful. Did you say you've included some recipes or is that online? We, I, I made recipes, they're online. Okay, yes. cool, cool, Yeah, cool. with pictures, everything. So awesome. once you get it out, you start cooking. There's savory recipes, there's sweet recipes. And when you see the base recipe for a waffle batter, you will see how easy it is to manipulate into different flavors. This is my basic waffle batter. Flour, egg, milk, pantry stuff. If I put cocoa powder in here, chocolate waffles. If I put yeah. matcha green tea powder, Ooh. green tea waffles. Nice. Cinnamon. Cinnamon waffles. Nice. And then you get creative with the stuffings and get the kids involved, get the grandkids involved. You know what else it's I think you should do? How about this, it's called chicken and waffles? Yes. Your fried chicken in the Absolutely. caloric and then your waffles yep. on the side, hello. Absolutely. Oh. Okay, you, you wanna hear something crazy. Chicken and waffles, I could put the same basic batter in there, take some of that fried chicken, chop it up, stuff it, and then put the waffle batter oh. on top. Oh. Hot honey, hot honey. Yes. Yum. That's what yes, I'm talking please. about. Now I go a little apple pie filling in here. These are half price, you guys. If you want to get They're a couple awesome. of these, another $20 gift idea. Just saying. And this is the kind of gift where it's not just about let's make a breakfast. This could be a new holiday tradition. Think about holiday morning, right? 
Kids are waking up, grandkids are waking up. We're not just gonna have the same old bowl of cereal on a special day like that. Right. Make yeah. waffles, make, look, you can crush up candy canes, you can make, you know, holiday oh, flavored that. waffles. Gingerbread flavored waffles, right? Think of all the different kind of, I mean, are we still in pumpkin spice season? Yes. We are, right? We are, until Thanksgiving pumpkin for spice. me. See, like, you know, you can go nuts, right? Yeah, As absolutely. we head into Thanksgiving, you could do a stuffing stuffed waffle. Like, you can go nuts. <laughs> Sweet, savory, making waffles you know what I love easier. is the idea of waking up on, like, whether it's Thanksgiving morning or the yeah. day after Thanksgiving yep. or Christmas morning or the day after New Year's morning. Yes. And then gather around. Sometimes you don't feel so great the next morning. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? <laughs> little waffle and Bloody little Mary. Little waffle and black coffee. <laughs> that might do it. Or that. That might do it. But that's what it is. I mean, think about on a holiday morning, that's nutrition. Get the kids, get the grandkids, yes. and say, okay, look, I can whip up a quick waffle batter. If you could do a pancake batter, you could do a waffle batter. And then set up a little bar. Have different toppings, different ways to flavor them. And kids will love that. You These know, are the kind of memories you want to create. I feel like the kids would be like, mom, dad, we're going to bring you breakfast in bed. <laughs> Wouldn't that be fun? They can do it. It the day will come. I promise well, my, you. One my, day. Not yet. Not, not yet. for a minute. They're young, but the day should come, and it will one day. If my two-year-old offers that, uh, well, maybe not so much. <laughs> maybe you need to monitor for a minute. But seriously, if, you know those little special moments of Mother's Day in bed, of course, or Father's of Day in bed, or you know yeah, all yeah, yeah. the things. Something about waffles to me is just a specialty. And when you get that smell like that one, that's the I'm first one we filled. I know you're like cradling it like, oh my gosh, I want to see it. <laughs> Is it that obvious? Well, we, we might need another minute, but like I told you, no shame in taking a peek, right? <gasps> oh, it's coming along. It's coming along. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, now, this just... is the magic moment I'm talking about because we saw that this one was really almost ready because, you know, you kind of mm. see the steam coming out of it. You can smell it. So imagine kids, grandkids, yeah, your family, you're I mean. upstairs waking up to this smell. Oh, you got, exactly. This is what and you want to do. And that's like the surprise and delight moment yeah. of like, ooh, what's in that one? Looks great. How about great. that one? And I'm with you. I like both sweet and savory. I'm yeah. typically more of a savory person, Absolutely. quite frankly. But this cherry cheesecake waffle? Recipe included. So again, you get that basic waffle batter. On the inside, you can put a little mascarpone or a little cream cheese, nice. some cherries, then top it with more batter, cherry cheesecake. We did a Rocky Road version. We did a green tea mm. version. We did a cookies and cream version. And then a ton of savory ones as well. You could do a cornbread waffle in here if you want to go savory with some leftover of that fried chicken. But I just love, again, that moment we just had where you have the steam coming out. That's that morning moment where you're like, ooh, it's a special yeah, morning. And then you true. get to pop this open and show the kids. This is the first the time best. we've done this low of a price, guys. This first time. It's not like $5 off. It's half price. It's awesome. It's half price. But I was just thinking, to your point, like, gosh, when I, the last time I went to a restaurant and I'd never had chicken waffles, I did recently. Yeah. I want to say it was sixteen ninety five or something. Probably. It was, it was yes, expensive. And I'm like, well, I should try it. Yeah. It was great. But when you can, it's nineteen ninety five to own the appliance that can make you the waffle, throw the chicken in your caloric. And, and think about the ingredients you're talking about. You got Add the chicken, syrup. right? You, even if it's a great way to recycle leftovers. You got fried chicken from last night. Yes. And you want a little brunch Thank idea. Thank you. Absolutely. Think about going out to brunch and paying for waffles. We're talking about base ingredients of, again, flour, milk, eggs. You got this stuff kicking exactly. around. Exactly. This isn't an $18 <laughs> thing, right? So don't go out and, and go to a brunch restaurant. You want this moment. You want this moment where, there. you know, the house is fi filled with that smell, and then you get to pop it open and say, ooh, ee, ooh, look, ooh, ooh. There's the That's cheddar one. That's the one with chicken and cheddar and There's jalapenos. There's the chicken and the cheddar and the jalapeno. I'm going to give it another minute, but By it's looking good. By the way, look good. at how cute they are. They don't take up a ton of space. Yeah, they, they're you great. Know, if you slide them into the side of a, a, can, a cupboard, uh, it, they're, they're really quite compact and beautifully designed. Yep. Uh, $3.99 to get yours. The black is available. I believe the red and the white are flying. I mean, they all are, needless to say. White, though, is the most limited. So if that's your color choice, don't wait. This is included, and this is the piece that you add to create that extra layer, that extra deep, like that stuffed. To make it stuffed. Yeah, that yeah, yeah. stuffed waffle. I think that's brilliant. You I can think do it's your cool. traditional. Or you can do the stuff. Exactly. And yeah. you have the choice. You can make them, you know, flat or traditional. You can make them stuffed. But really, once you master a simple batter, you can do anything. Such and a good And you get point. these moments where you get that steam. Your house smells so good. And you get to reveal to your kids or your grandkids or your guests, this is what we made. Now, this is the yeah. apple pie stuffed. And this is what? This was only about five minutes. You can see, by the way, I love that our appliances, a lot of our appliances don't 
have a lot to them for a reason. There's no controls. There's just an on and off, right? So you don't have to fiddle with the heat. You don't have to guess. You just turn it on. Eventually, you're going to see that steam come out. You're going to smell those fresh waffles. Check this out, you guys. Isn't it beautiful? Look at it on both sides. Look at how perfectly Perfect. brown. This is one of the stuffed waffles. And it's in fact, awesome. I'm going to open this up. Open it up. Because it, it's cool enough to do that. Now, look at that. And look at, I mean, I love how it's all in there, and then you cut into it. Mm. It soaks up the syrup. It soaks up the hot honey oh. if you're into that sort of thing. Just seriously? Great. Almost could be a neat alternative to a traditional apple pie, yeah, cherry absolutely. pie for, you know, sometimes you're like, no, you know, do this a, could be fun, and, and more go interesting. Savory. Do a cornbread waffle over here. We did that some leftover good. stuffing with that leftover turkey heading into the holidays. Is cranberries in there? A little cranberry Love sauce. That. Like, it's awesome. You could do anything. I think this is so fun to get that creative. Look at how pretty that is. Oh, it smells good. Which one? Oh, yeah, that's I the... do like the jalapeno. Ooh. And I... There's oh, that that's chocolate. the one. And you see, and again, strawberries. all these recipes you can do, chocolate, cookies and cream, Rocky Road, you could do a gingerbread, pumpkin spice would be so cool. Once you master waffle batter, it's basically a pancake batter, a little bit thicker, you can do anything. You're one ingredient away from taking that base batter into so many different directions and set up a bar for your guests, yeah. for your kids or your grandkids. That could be a fun morning, like absolutely. A, a morning brunch after Christmas. When you think about the ingredients and what they cost. Yeah. Absolutely. A dollar for a whole batch? I mean, you know, when you Less. Flour, right? Flour, egg, and, you know, milk. Yeah. It's it's And it's awesome. easy. You and just it's pour easy. it in, you walk away, and you don't even have to flip it. It's almost like when, when your senses tell you, like we did it in real time, when the steam came out, we went, ooh, <laughs> I think it's done. We did. That's basically it. You know, so we're not playing with controls, adjusting heat. It's yeah, super easy. Exactly. There's no knobs to have to even worry yeah. about. So your item is 832-347. 832-347. Most limited is the white. We do have red. We do have black. Everybody gets that extra oh, yeah. piece. This is that cat, you know, that wonderful non-stick that you can add for that extra layer to make it a stuffed well waffle or a Belgian waffle. Look How at that. Oh, that's gonna be amazing. We're that gonna let that gonna cool. We'll have that for dessert in a few minutes. <laughs> uh, but we've got more from Kitchen.